Hallelujah to Jesus. Today is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. I pray for you and I pray for your entire household according to the prophetic word of the living God. By the efficacy of the blood of the Lamb and according to his word in 1 Peter chapter 2 and verse 24, who his own bore on his own bore our sins in his own body and on the tree that we being dead to sin shall live unto righteousness by whose stripes we are healed. In the name of the Lord Jesus, I pray that may the hand of the Lord preserve you, may the hand of the Lord protect you and protect your entire household. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, today I pray that God in his infinite mercy will remember you and remember your entire household. His grace shall speak for you. It will bless you above measure and it will cut off every limitation that draws you back. Your battle with poverty is over. Your battles with sicknesses are over. Your battles of shame and ostracization is over today in the name of the Lord Jesus. By the redemptive blood of the Lamb, your doubts over your coming miracle shall be settled in the name of the Lord Jesus. Today, the Lord will settle every controversy concerning your life. God will calm every storm that is raging against you and that is raging against your destiny. He will calm it down for you in the name of the Lord Jesus. This week, I pray that may the hand of the Lord preserve you. May the Spirit of the living God be your reward. I pray for you this very day in the name of the Lord Jesus, we declare that every stone of the wicked thrown against you shall be deflected back to sender in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every plot, every scheme, every machination of the enemy concerning your life today will return back to sender in the name of the Lord Jesus. Every disfavor against your life shall be scattered by the fire of the Holy Ghost. The pit of the enemy shall swallow their diggers in the name of the Lord Jesus. Decision of your enemies against you shall backfire. Owners of evil loads shall carry their evil load themselves in the name of Jesus. Whatever they have planned, whatever they have purpose against your life this very week, it shall be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Every evil pronouncement and altars and utterances against your life today shall be now and void in the name of Jesus. This week I pray that may the grace of the Lord go ahead of you. May the Lord God Almighty preserve your life. This week I pray by the covenant of the blood of Jesus that may the Lord preserve you and preserve your entire household. May the Lord defend you against the terror at night. May the Lord defend you against every schemes and every plans of the enemy. Today the light of God shall shine upon your path and you shall be led by the glory of God. God's wisdom shall guide your step that you take and you shall know peace in all decisions that you make this very week. You shall be empowered to foresee and accelerate with divine favor. And the Lord will actualize every beautiful plan that you have this very week. That God will show you mercy in every area of your life, including your children, including your husband and your wife, in the name of Jesus. You shall receive clear insight to locate your central point of fulfillment. Every satanic foundation of shame, struggle and failure in your life shall dry up this very day. The Lord shall channel steps of victory into your path. You shall grow beyond your present level. You shall increase in every side. Your hindrances on your way to success today shall be crushed by the fire of the Holy Ghost. I pray that this week may the Lord go ahead of you. May the Lord preserve you. I ask the grace of God to release your due blessings and your entitlement unto your life and anything that entitles you for divine benefit, raise and lift. This week shall be your portion in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus. Go in the strength of the Lord and in the strength of his might. May the Lord preserve and watch over you. May the Lord bless your waters. May the Lord bless your going out and coming in. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we have prayed. This is Apostle Dr. Jerry Ortega from Global Harvest Ministries Worldwide. And remember, you are a property of the Holy Ghost. Satan, back off. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.